and have yourself a merry little Christmas now. Hey, and welcome to the second video in my six part series. It's Christmas. Hands down, have yourself a merry little Christmas is my favorite Christmas song of all time. The song was written in the 40s and the songwriters in those days quite often would put two chord changes to the bar. So this song is quite advanced, but don't worry because I'm going to show you some tricks to make it easier to play. Now at the end of the video, there's going to be a playthrough. So make sure you hang around and we'll do the song together. We're in the key of G, so we have a G chord. And the very next one is an E minor. And now you probably know that shape. But because we're on the G, it's easy to put our pinky right there on the fourth fret of the C string to make our E minor shape. So I'm actually leaving that finger there. I'm not lifting it up. I'm just adding it there. So this is what you would do if you were playing a blues shuffle in G. It's just a nice shortcut. So we have G, which is the one chord, to the E minor, which is the six chord. Then we're going to the A minor, which is the two chord, to the D, which is the five chord. So you have one, six, two, five, which is a really standard jazz chord progression. Just file that back in the mind somewhere. <laughs> I'm going to use the island strum again. Down, up, chuck, up, down, up, chuck, up, down, up, chuck, up, down, up, chuck. And yes, it has a lot of swing. One, a two, a three, a four, a one, a two, a three, a four. And it's quite slow. There's a turnaround that happens at the beginning of the song and also in between the two A sections. And that goes B7 to E7 to A7 to D7. The B7 I like to use is that shape, which is your E minor, moved up one string close to your face. Thank you, James Hill, for the analogy. It is the twins. They go very well together. In the B section, we have C to C minor. I'm gonna use my first finger to bar the bottom three strings for my C minor. You could play this C minor, which is barring the third fret and using your ring man two frets up on the top string, because we are going to play a B minor soon. So up to you, but I like to keep that nice and simple. So we have, here we are as in olden days. That's your B minor. Happy golden days, A minor to D to G for two, two bars or a whole bar in fact. One, two, three, four. Have you noticed how nearly every single bar has got two chord changes in it? There's occasional ones where there's one bar and that's one of them. Okay, the second half of this is goes to the E minor. Now, because we're on the G, we could go and use that trick again. G to E minor. Now here's a chord that you may not know. It's F sharp seven. So the one I like to play for this song from that chord is this. Two fingers down the bottom here on zero one, zero one. And then you want to put your pinky up here so that you're doubling up on that note. That's F sharp seven, believe it or not. You could play this shape, which is your E seven moved up and you cover the second string with your first finger. But I think coming from this shape here is the obvious thing to do. So you just 
sliding down and then moving your pinky over to the top string, third fret. And I like the sound too. So you end up with this. And then the next chord after that is your B minor. To a D. To E minor. To A7. And then D. To D7. During this series you'll notice that I vary which D7 shape I play. 2020 is one that I favour, but I do occasionally like the sound of this one, which is barring the second fret and using the C note there on the bottom string and the third fret. Before I do the playthrough, I just want to talk about Carla. Carla was my very first ukulele and I still recommend them. They're an excellent brand, they're very consistent, and if you would like 10% off anything off the Carla Brown website, use my link below or up here. I've made up my own ending to this song and it goes like this. So from Have yourself a merry little Christmas E flat to C minor to G. you wanted to do a fancy G, you could come right up here on the seventh fret and bar and put your pinky two frets above that. And that's a G chord. So you'd end up with A song sheet for this lesson is available over at Stu's Patreon page, patreon.com forward stroke ukumullum. Head over there and grab it now. Now it's time for the playthrough. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Let your heart be light. From now on, our troubles will be out of sight. Have yourself a merry little Christmas, like the Yuletide gay. From now on, our troubles will be miles away. Here we are, as in olden days, happy golden days of yore. Faithful friends who are dear to us, gather near to us once more. Through the years, we all will be together. If the fates allow Hang your shining star upon the highest bough And have yourself a merry little Christmas now Happy golden days of your faithful friends who are dear to us, gather near to us once more. Through the years we all will be together, if the fates allow. 
Hang your shining star upon the highest bough And have yourself a merry little Christmas now If you've learned something today, please do give me a like share me with your friends and you know I want to hear from you so leave me a comment below. Thanks so much for hanging out with me all the way to the end of the video. It means the world to me. It helps these videos reach other people. So you're getting a gold star. Hey if you enjoyed yourself you're going to love this one. I'll see you over there.